Yo, what's up guys? I found an old ASOS Wi-Fi router and this product is way back year 2015. I decided to make use of this as a Wi-Fi repeater. Now, when I logged into this uh, ASOS Wi-Fi router, I found out that there are three easy to configure modes. It is called wireless router mode, repeater mode, and access point mode. Uh, since I want to make use of it as a Wi-Fi repeater, I would like to show you how I will configure it. Now we can start by simply saying, since it's old, we do not know if there's a configuration or not. We do not know the username or password because it's not brand new, so it's not running its default configuration. Now every router we have, there's a reset button here. We can use this one to erase every configuration and put it back to its factory default settings. Now for other Wi-Fi routers or other devices, it would be a hole like that so you would need a pin to push into that. Now, for this Wi-Fi router, it, it is a button. If you can see it here, it's a button. So that we can all start from zero, guys. I'm just going to power this one on and try to see the lights here. So if you can see, uh, it's going to power on. It will take around uh, five to eight seconds to settle down. And if you see, you have the second light there. And if nothing's going to happen already, then it's time to press this button. Hold it for around five seconds to 10 seconds until I see something on the light indicator here that there's something happening, something like that. So let's, let's see. So I'm going to press that one and then uh, press and hold, wait for the light. It will show up something different. That's still normal. You see that light, that's the time you release the button, okay? And all the configurations of this Wi-Fi router will go back to its default setting. So it's time for us to plug this one to our uh, laptop and start configuring it, okay? So I'll plug my cable here, guys. Plug it here on the LAN ports, okay? Make sure you plug it on one of the LAN ports and don't plug it on something that says WAN or WAN or internet port. Now, if you have your Wi-Fi router plugged in, it will automatically pop in the browser and open up where you can start the configuration like what we have here. We can go for manual settings so that we can choose which mode this Wi-Fi router is going to work. And we can go for the basic configuration here. Router login, let's go for admin and just put in a password you like. And next, this is the option I was talking about where you can use this one as a wireless router mode, repeater mode, or access point mode. So what we're going to do, there are quick explanatory things that you can read here. So when I click on repeater mode, in repeater mode, RTN12 wirelessly connects to existing wireless network. So once we have configured this one, it means to say that we don't need a cable to connect to the main router. This will connect wirelessly to the uh, main router. So as you can see in the diagram here, this is your main Wi-Fi router. This is your repeater, this ASOS Wi-Fi router. It's going to connect to this main Wi-Fi router and rebroadcast that wireless signal so that other devices can connect, okay? And uh, take note here in this mode, the firewall, IP sharing, and NAT functions are disabled. Okay, so this is what we want, repeater mode. Next. It will scan the SSID of the uh, network we're going to connect to. I'm going to use this hidden network, okay? This is my Wi-Fi SSID, so I, I named it as hidden network. So I'll click that and put in my password so that we can authenticate. All right, and then connect. So we'll go for next with this one. Next. And um, this is uh, the recommended um, uh, SSID that this Wi-Fi router is kind of giving us. So hidden network underscore RPT, it means repeat, so that we can identify my main wireless signal to my repeater. So I'm going to click on apply. And please wait, the RT12 is connecting to the hidden network. Now what's going to happen here is 
uh, we might lose connection. So we're going to wait for about, I don't know, uh, 30 to one minute uh, probably. Okay, it's done. So we'll not be able to connect to this, uh, or to that Wi-Fi router, we'll be disconnected. So what I'm going to do guys is try to connect to that wireless signal that we created. So I'm going to go for my Wi-Fi and I should sit here. So this is my main wireless signal. This is the repeated one. I'm going to connect, connect, and I'll put in the password. And next, let's make sure I can um, do internet surfing so that uh, we are sure that it's working. Basically, we don't need this um, anymore. Uh, once we are connected to the uh, hidden network repeated signal, then we're all good to go. Hidden network RPT connected secured. So let's just go ahead and Google. Yay, gotcha. And again, I'm going to show you that. Um, close this. I'm going to show you that Wi-Fi. See here, okay? Hidden network, this is my main. That's all about it, guys. I hope you have learned something from this video. If it's your first time here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribers. Hope to see you in my next video. Goodbye.